Hey guys, uh, Lucky from Busted Stud. Uh, tonight we got the uh, Honda Accord uh, 2005. Customers complaining about a little noise from the brakes. Let's take a look. Come on with me. All right, so I can see part of the problem here. This road is all uh, gouged up. Pads are kind of thin. I don't know, the caliper might be bad. We're gonna give it a shot. We're gonna do a brake job on this thing. So we're gonna get started, blow the wheel off. We'll take a look at it. We'll see how it comes out. All right. All right, so I'm just going to blast the uh, wheel off real quick. One second. I already feel like there's going to be a problem here. I'll let you know in a minute. Yeah, I figured as much. This wheel's on there pretty good. Uh, if I can give it like a little. Okay, no, nope, not really. It's not coming off. Okay. Alright, so these uh, aluminum wheels, they're kind of seized on there, uh, not coming off, get it like, give it a kick, that's the trick, that's it. Just like Conor McGregor. <laughs> <laughs> this could be bad, you don't know. You got it? Mm-hmm. Oh Let's get And you're good. Alright, so you got to take out this screw, it's just holding the, the uh, rotor to the backing plates, a little rusty, you got this special impact tool. Uh, this might be the solution we need. Let me give it a try here. Just tap it in, get it in nice. Give it a little setup and. And uh, that's pretty much the only tool you're going to use to get that out of there. It's all rusted. So. Alright, we're going to uh, just pry the uh, caliper off. Good. Oh shit. Okay. Not bad. A little bit of a problem, but that's okay. Never a problem in Busted Studs Garage. <laughs> <laughs> um, excellent. Well, that slide moves, and this one's kind of locked up. We're going to have to fix that. Uh, we're just going to blast off the caliper bracket and hopefully take this uh, rotor right off of here. So, yeah. Okay, so we pulled off the caliper bracket, and now we're going to get the rotor off because this rotor is no good. Uh, Basically, you're gonna hit it right here, and right here. Okay. It's just off the road. Yeah. It'll come off. Let's get behind it. So when I said, okay, it's like that. Yeah. Any here? Peel a few things out of there before it's been pulled out. Brake slide grease peat. Are those all going to be used or no? No, just there's a couple different sizes in this kit, and I got to match up what I pulled out. Which one of these guys is what I pulled out. These guys will go right back in. Okay, right in the Ooh. dog's water. <laughs> got it. I like to have them water cool. I know it's clean though. Yeah, yeah. I don't know if the dog's going to appreciate that. So, you want to put some uh, grease right here. With the, uh, so one of the things aluminum slot, uh, the stainless slides are gonna go. And the so other thing you want to do is better. get some grease on they these giant, pins. Because if these corrode, it's gonna cause premature yeah. failure of your brakes. Yeah, that, that's like a, uh, that's and that's awesome. kind of what happened here. This was seized up a little yeah. bit. That's not the only problem we had, but. This is, uh, uh, I have the whole full picture with all the trucks and everything. What now? Uh, grease it up nice. Put it on. That's pretty good. Now these little uh, brackets go on here. Just give it like a little click. Right in there. I don't know what's happening, but it's going to be pretty good. Uh, like this. Yep, and then this guy goes in here, not bad, just like, uh, just like that. And this guy goes on this side, just like this. This road is entirely junk, see the missing pieces? I don't know, it looks like a little light, light left yep. in it. And here's the new one we got, so we're just gonna throw that guy right on here. We'll line up the holes. Yeah, uh, where the screws go. Pretty good. Put the screws back in. If 
If I love this guy, I would put anti seize on there. So basically, got the caliper bracket ready to go on. This guy slides right on here carefully. Oh, need the hardware, which is where's the impact? Uh, right over here. Oh, uh, don't know. Merck used it on the front of the car. Get this on here. Good. We'll crank those guys down. And then we just got to change this clip on the caliper. It's one of these. Uh, I can need a screwdriver to get it out, but it's an anti rattle clip. So, uh, got this all set. I didn't have the tool to twist in the caliper. I need a big screwdriver. Just come over here. You can see there's a slot right here. Basically twisted it in and pushed it. Was able to get that in. Uh, we have the tool somewhere, I couldn't find it. Then the tricky part was to put this uh, anti-vibration clip on. That's all set. So now we're ready to bolt up the caliper and wrap up this brake job. So this goes right here. Grab the hardware, throw it in. Looking good. Going right in nice. Going in real nice. Where's the other one? Pete, the other right here, perfect. Yeah, it's on the, this guy here on the back. So do you think you've got a drawer where you might have a duplicate? Okay, putting these down, and then this side will be done. All right, looking pretty good. I think uh, we solved this problem. Now we're gonna go do the other side. So let's hope the other side comes apart a little less uh, of a challenge. Thanks. <laughs>